Good morning, guys. It is Tuesday morning around 8.30. I am doing a day in the life vlog today, and today is the first full day we've been back from our little vacation that Ty and I went on. Scarlett's back here. Scarlett, can you say good morning? Good morning. <laughs> She's eating a fruit roll-up thing. Um, but anyways, if you're not aware, Ty and I went to Huntington Beach, California this past weekend. It was amazing. Oh my gosh, it was such a fun trip. This was the first time we had been away from Scarlet for more than a night, and it was so incredibly needed. Like, we had the best time. We got to reconnect. We spent a ton of quality one-on-one -on -one time, had great conversations, and you guys, it was amazing we are really going to try to do this more often and just make it happen because we both realized how bad we needed this for each other and for our marriage but we stayed at the huntington hyatt regency resort i think that's what it's called it was beautiful i cannot recommend it enough it was in a prime location it was really close to Pasea or Pacific City I don't know exactly what you call it and Main Street and there was just so much to do the resort had amazing food and it was just beautiful I also got to meet up with one of my really good friends Brooke who moved back to California so it was really nice to see her and her family and little Blair but anyways I ended up taking a few clips from when I was out in the mornings and I figured I would insert them right here for you guys wasn't gonna vlog while I was here but I'm sitting out by the ocean by myself Ty still sleeping it's pretty early in the morning and I just wanted to hop on here and say I am in my happy place this is so amazing here here's the ocean it's just gorgeous this is a really nice beach by the way and we are staying at this um, area right here our hotel or resort is just right across the street but this beach is amazing like it's huge first of all the sand is really nice I just took my shoes off I have my coffee over here they have a Starbucks at a resort got a caramel macchiato and then I'm trying to chug this water it is cold out here I think it's like 50 degrees right now but it is just so incredibly relaxing of our little vacation. I am at the beach one last time. I've been coming here every single morning by myself while Ty sleeps in, mainly because Ty loves sleeping in and I love being out here by myself. Like it's so peaceful and there's nobody out here. So I get up early and I come out here and it is just, it is just amazing. We actually check out in like 30 minutes. I need to go back to the room and get our stuff packed but I am just like completely procrastinating. I'm sure you can imagine why. So this is our resort, and this is a little bridge I would take every single morning to walk down to the beach. So the beach is right there. It connects the resort to the beach. But yeah, that was our little vacation. We are in the car right now, obviously. We have to go pick up Indy um, because he's still at the borders. We boarded him while we were gone. Who are we gonna go get? Indy. We're gonna go get Indy. Are you so excited to see him? Yeah. Yeah. You gonna give him a big? Where are they going? He's been playing with his friends. Remember? So it was very traumatic when we dropped off Indy last week. Um, Scarlett was with me and she did not want to leave him here. You were sad when we left Indy, weren't you? <laughs> yeah, let's go get him. Come on. <laughs> yeah, you excited? Mommy first. I got it right here. Let's go. Oh, mommy first. I did this way. Oh, Indy! We just picked up Indy. Scarlett's so happy. You were sad when we dropped him off, and now you're happy though, right? When he saw us, he collapsed to the floor on his back. And he said by you. Okay, guys, already. Okay. 
first thing done of the day. Andy has been picked up. You can probably hear him back there. Where are my keys? <laughs> I said Andy. You did. He is so excited to be back. So we're gonna run home now and take Andy home, drop him off, and then Scarlett and I are gonna run over to Target because we're out of like all the necessities since we've been gone. Okay, we are home, dropping Andy off. Be right back, Scar. Okay, you ready to be home? Oh, so happy to be home. Get him some fresh water. Here, bud. Andy, here, you want a drink? Okay. I love you. We'll be right back. Oh. Oh. You are so cute. Scarlett's eating a cake pop and I got a black coffee. Real original today. <laughs> With cream. I put some cream in it. And we're just getting some groceries. I have bananas, some fruit, celery. Papa Oh. I want the Those are juices. Who's that? Who's that one? Bubba. And who's this one? Hey! <laughs> this is how she likes to ride on the cart. <laughs> is that fun? What you can control. We fly, we fly. Try so hard to get there, and we might, we might be lost, but not forever. We are home and I thought I'd quickly give you guys a little Target haul with everything that we got at Target. This is all stuff I still need to put away from our trip. I picked up some celery. I like getting Trader Joe's celery better, so I just picked up one to get me through to tomorrow. I'm starting back on celery juice starting today. I got some strawberries for Scarlet, some eggs. They didn't have my brown eggs at Target. And I think the brown eggs taste so much better. So I just had to get the white ones. Got some whole milk for Scarlett. These are the wipes that I've been using for her that I really like. Um, they're by Huggies, the Natural Care. Pampers, Easy Ups are my favorite training pants for her. We do 2T to 3T. Bananas, this is my all-time favorite bread. The Dave's Killer Bread. It's a much healthier option for you than regular white bread. Scarlett was begging her Cinnamon Toast Crunch, so I got her Cinnamon Toast Crunch. I got her a few things to keep in the freezer. So I got her fish sticks, she loves these by Kid Fresh. And then the Uncrustables. And we've never had these, but I figured we'd give them a shot. They're mini French toast bites by Earth's Best. And then I got a few things just to keep in the snack bin. So some of these little twist um, ropes that are like a fruit rope by Simply Balanced, and then these fruit strips as well. She loves these. And then I got this to put in our snack area as well. I got some French vanilla coffee mate creamer for my coffee. I picked up Scarlett some shampoo by Baby Dove. And then this stuff is for a sensory project I'm gonna do, um, which I'll show you guys when I do it. But this was in the dollar section. It's just crazy string. Figured that'd be a fun little activity. And then this bubble bath is also for a sensory play activity. I got some cottage cheese. This looked really good, so I bought this for myself and I'm hoping Scarlett will eat this. She's never tried it before. Um, I love, love this pan seared garlic and herb tilapia. It's so good. So I got some of this to keep in the freezer. I picked Scarlett up some more socks because she was running low. I don't think I've ever seen this Universal Threads um, shirt with the army print. I love these tees. I wore these like all last summer and they're $8, so I picked up this army print one. And then last but not least, I got a card um, for Bailey. I already have her present, which I'll show you guys later. So this is my little snack bin for Scarlett. I just pull this out whenever she's ready for a snack and she gets to pick something out. You want one of those? Yeah. Okay, you can have one. You want me to help you open it? Okay. <laughs> Okay, Mama. Do you want me to open it for you? Okay. Let's see, it's a surprise. We just got a package in from your little dove, the cutest, cutest little kid's boutique. And so I know what it is. Scarlett does not. She's going to be so excited. What is that? I think I'm going to have to put it together for you. Okay. So this is a bike. You have your own bike. Look at that. I got my own bike. You do. Look at this. Your own little scoops for our sensory projects. So when you scoop beans, you can use these little scoops. How cute is that? 
cute is this bike this is the perfect balance bike and it's all wood and this little basket was separate but um, it's really cute she's trying to fit her balls in it Cindy is actually the owner of your little dove she just recently started up her business and it is the cutest boutique ever check out her Instagram it's totally my style you guys will love them but I'll leave a link down below in the description box to your little dove um, but we're just outside right now I'm gonna let Scarlett play outside it's finally not freezing here I think it's supposed to be 70s all week, which is more normal for us here in Arizona. We're gonna hang out here for a little bit. I think I might go grab my computer and start doing a little bit of editing too, if she'll let me. Scarlett is requesting, oh my gosh, <laughs> to play with her beans. So we're gonna do a little sensory play. I'm just putting them all in this bowl. I'm gonna give her this and let her play. She's over here waiting so patiently. We had to do an outfit change too because she got filthy from outside. So then she has her little scoops from your little dove that she can use to scoop the beans and put them in the little muffin tin. I shared this activity in my last day in the life vlog. And so many of you guys have told me how amazing it has been with your child. It will keep her busy forever. But I am currently working on trying to get a few things picked up. Let me just, let me just quickly show you guys what is going on in my house right now because it's a disaster. I have all of this stuff I need to pick up. This, like all of this junk needs to be put away. There's Indy's kennel. Um, this bag needs to be unpacked. That was Scarlet's. And then in my bedroom, this is my luggage and like Ty's stuff. I need to go through all of this and wash everything and then just like get this room picked up because it's a disaster. It's just about 12.30 so it's almost nap time. At nap time, I really, really, really want to watch The Bachelor because I have to watch it a day later because I don't have cable. So I watched it on Hulu and it comes out the day after it's aired. So I'm super pumped to watch it because it's hometown. I already know who wins. Thanks, Nicole. Um, but I'm also the kind of person who looks it up. I'm not gonna like tell you guys or anything, but I think I'm, I think I'm pretty happy with the, the end result. It's nap time and I'm making some food, meeting my all time favorite <laughs> banana toast. And in case you guys are new here, I just use Dave Killer's bread. I add some peanut butter and then I do chia seeds too from Trader Joe's, a banana, and then I have been topping mine with just a little bit of honey. I started The Bachelor. I'm gonna go sit down and watch this while I eat. All right, Bachelor is on. I've eaten something and I am about ready to tackle all of this now. I wanna go this under. I know we're going somewhere. Into the danger zone. Can you scrub off all the sand? We're doing a really quick activity. This was kind of a last minute idea. These are seashells that I collected on the beach when we were in Huntington and I brought them back for Scarlet. You got it? Kind of stuck in there. So I have a bowl of water with some bubbles. This is just dish soap in that and I have her little scrubbing brush and she's washing all the sand off. You're doing a good job. And then Scarlet, once they're all clean, you can set them on this little this little um, pan to let them dry, okay? Yeah. So this is our after nap time activity we're doing right now. It is a lot later now, it is almost seven o'clock and I'm actually heading out with a few girlfriends. Ty's giving Scarlett a bath right now. But uh, I'm going out for Bailey's birthday. My friend Bailey's birthday's in a few days and tonight we're celebrating. So it's gonna be Nicole, Bailey and I. Nicole and I are surprising Bailey with a cake from Lisa's Rum Cakes, my all time favorite cake place. So we got our cake, I'll show you guys here in a second. But first I wanted to show you guys what I'm wearing out. So this is what I'm wearing out. It's still kind of chilly. I think it's probably gonna be in the 60s. So um, this sweater is like an oversized sweater from Free People. It's actually really old. I got it a long time ago. And then my bralettes also from Free People. These are the black jeans that I always wear. I actually just cuffed them at the bottom. They're from Old Navy, they're the Rockstar denim. And then my sandals are from American Eagle. And then I have my 
Kendra Scott cuff on. My earrings are just like simple studs. I, I don't even know where from. Maybe Charming Charlie Charlie's or something like that. So this is the gift that I got Bailey and I thought I'd just quickly show you guys because this is an amazing gift for somebody. So at least I think it is. <laughs> so this is from Lush and it's like a gift set that they have. They have a ton of these and I got the um, all the bath bomb ones. I think they're all bath bombs. There's a bubble bar in there too and a bath oil but um it shows everything that's inside there's four bath or three bath bombs a bubble bar and then a bath oil and it's already wrapped like this and packaged like this it's a really good gift and then how I cute did that turn out this is happy birthday bailey so i think she's gonna love that this is a strawberry rum cake my absolute favorite from lisa's rum cakes if you guys are in the area you definitely have to try them i actually think they ship too so you can order from them and have it shipped anywhere in the United States. I'm not 100% positive, but I almost think that's a thing. <laughs> you can check their website. I've already changed my outfit and I wanted to show you guys just slightly. I put my hair up because it was driving me crazy and I forgot I needed to get a little purse. So um, I actually got this for our trip when we were in California. Um, it's by Michael Kors. I got it on major sale at Dillard's and it's like a blush pink. And I changed my shoes because I don't think the sandals were working with this outfit, to be honest. Like, Scarlett is still taking a bath. I am not gonna vlog tonight, so I'm gonna go ahead and just cut the vlog off right here. And I hope you guys enjoyed today's day in the life vlog. Let's not get her in here and get my comments disabled. All these creeps out there. If you guys enjoyed today's video, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you're new. Friday's video is going to be a Trader Joe's grocery haul, so stay tuned for that. And I'll see you in my next one. Bye guys. Bye.